What's up hill climbers? In this episode, I'm gonna be going over the Road Skulls Straight Shooter and seeing if it helps with hill climb or not. Let's get to it. Right, so I pulled the Road Skulls fan out of here. All right, let's try it out. So here is the Road School Straight Shooter. This is the box that it comes in. It is a very cool looking box. 16 to 22 KTM, that's what this is, a 2019 KTM 450 SXF. So Kevin over at Road Schools hit me up and wanted to see if this would work for hill climb. So you open up the box and it has install instructions right here. So I'm gonna scan that here in a minute and try to figure out how to set it up on the bike. Kevin said it was very easy. All right, so we got a sticker. Road Schools sends you a freaking air filter with the fan kit. So let's take this air filter off so you guys can get a better look at what we are dealing with. We got some wires and things that we are going to hook up. So I pulled the Road Skulls fan out of here. So it's a custom size uh, air filter cage to your bike and it's built in with the Road Skulls patent fan. Now this isn't some gimmicky fan that is dinky and is a joke. Go on the Road Skulls website, call Kevin, and he will tell you that this fan is no joke. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this back in my air filter, and then we are going to hook everything up. I oiled up my air filter that Straight Shooter gives you. I got the ground going to the ground, and I got the positive going to the positive, the two wires they give you. So it comes down through here, and you make this connection, and then drill a hole and connect that. And then whenever you're ready to go, you just plug in your straight shooter. So you plug in this to that with the air filter on it, all good to go. We have made it to the riding spot. Again, I'm gonna go ahead and ride around with my stock air filter cage and air filter. After I ride around for a little bit, I'm gonna come back, get the Road Skulls straight shooter and put it into my dirt bike and then ride around and see the difference. <laughs> All right, I've got the straight shooter installed, the fan wire connecting to the power wire and the button. Sweet. All right, let's try it out. Yeah. All right. Yeah, way more, way more response right off the rip and then the mid range. Not so much in the high end, um, but the mid range 100%. So let's go ahead and go on a good ride and see what this thing can do.
was a good one. Yeah, that's good practice right there. The Road School Straight Shooter is doing phenomenal. I love it. Uh, way more, way more instant hit. So yeah. Bag comes off. <laughs> I say we move on to the next hillside. This thing's doing awesome. I freaking love it. There's only one line on this hill that I like. Let's get it. This hill looks like it ain't been hit in a while. Uh, my 
my, my 14 tooth front sprocket is causing the motor, motor to bog a little bit, but this Road Skulls uh, straight shooter is helping out with that like bottom end like grunt because it's trying to suck air. So I love it. It's working out good so far. But yeah, having a good time climbing these hills. All right, let's take a little quick breather and then we'll go to another section of hills. cavity. Let's check this hillside out. It's been a while since I've been here. I'm gonna at least get up that line and get up one over here. Turn this thing on. finished my ride with the Road Skulls straight shooter for about six hours um, and I really noticed it right as soon as I gave it gas and about the mid range. Uh, top end you really don't see a difference uh, and that's what Kevin at Road Skulls said but I really did notice a difference with the bottom and mid range power. I love it. I'm going to continue to run it on my dirt bike and I'm going to run it on my race hill climb bike whenever I go to the races. The only thing I got to change is my front sprocket is a 14 tooth and it's kind of killing me on the right off the rip because a 14 is a pretty big sprocket and it takes a little bit of giddy up to get that thing moving so I'm going to drop down to a 13 tooth and with that straight shooter it's going to be amazing so anyways thanks for watching the video if you want to learn how to set your dirt bike up like I did click the link below it's a five day free training series on how you can set your bike up like mine it's literally me showing you how I set this bike up to ride all over the country and free ride everywhere. So thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next videos. We got a lot of hill climb coming up. Um, I have a lot of footage backed up from our hill climb trips and a lot of different things. So stay tuned. It's going to be an awesome wild ride. Check out the Road Skulls straight shooter thing is amazing. Catch you on the next one.